Hello everyone. Robert Caldwell Simulator XD videos here. And today I'm going to give you all some tips for recording your GoAnimate videos perfectly when using Screen Recorder. Now let's get started. Okay, two things are wrong here when screen recording. First you have too many tab bars open. The more there is that is open, the more laggy your videos will be when recording them. So be sure to make sure nothing else is running in the process that will slow down memory and data of the processor. But if I was you, I suggest going with the Intel Core i5 or i7 processors. Because they will give more speed to your computer and will reduce lags on your animations. Tip number 2. Don't record you screen to the size of the screen that's not close up where you can see background stuff. And yeah I know that if you record your video in full screen, the video will run even more laggy, but what helps is that after you make a video, go to your preview button on your on you video maker that you made. Click it, the it will bring you to this video page. That way you can get rid of watermarks here and I'll show you how to record closer in your preview. So, to make sure your videos is record closer, set your Google browser screen to 250%. That way you can record your video into a high quality with 1080 pixels, and without lags. Also, you don't want any watermarks in the way, so I suggest you use these codes in your request list so you don't have to see the watermarks. It will be in the description. Now when you start to record your video, before pressing play on your video, start your screen recorder first to record, and then play your video. That way you can use a special program to crop this beginning edge of your loading screen you don't need in your videos, and I recommend you use this screen recorder on your Google store called Nimbus Screenshot. Because this screen recorder is perfect because 1. It has no watermarks. And two, you can record for as long as you want without no time limit. And when you record your videos with this program, make sure you record your video quality to 1920 of 1080p with full HD. And make sure your audio bitrate is 128k bits to boost the audio quality. And put your videos to 30 frames per second so that screen recorder captures every frame seen in the video while it films it. Also keep your video bitrate to 400k bits to capture video. YouTube notification pop-ups that interferes when you're recording a VOD video. Trust me, you don't want those in the way of your videos. Before you record, make sure you sign out of your Google, YouTube, or even any online media accounts so no notifications pop up while you're recording your VOD videos. After you record your videos, your videos will come out in the WEBM format, and that's not good because you won't have any sound. But that's okay, because there's a way to convert it into the MP4 format, and also a way to crop the video too. Go to the website called 123 Apps and go to online video cutter. The link to it will be in the description. When using this, this will help you to convert your video to the MP4 format. And you can also cut out scenes from your videos you don't need or want. And so you can crop your screen out. So when doing this, make sure you pull the scene timeline cutter to the right spot from the beginning when you recorded your video without the screen loader showing. Then do the same thing for the other part from the beginning without the replay button showing. Next, make sure you crop your video screen out really good without edges showing by hitting the crop box right here. Then, go to the quality box. Open it up and select it as 1080p for a good high quality and better high definition. After that, go to this button and click cut. And then just click download and then you're done. So those was just all of the tips for just for you all to do better screen recording for your GoAnimate videos. That's my way for recording VOD videos. So I just hope you all follow these simple steps in using screen recorder to record your videos. If any problems, please leave it in the comments below. So goodbye and this is me, signing out.